Kayla Marina now joins us from the Sports Bureau on how ASU is adapting to new technology. College football adopted helmet technology communication this season that allows coaches to communicate with players with a player on the field. This interest sparked this interest in the new rule change gained a lot of traction after the Michigan sign stealing scandal from last season. While they are still getting used to it, the Sun Devils say it is working well for them so far. Arizona State football has been through many changes prior to the season, most notably changes in the NCAA rulebook, one involving next level technology. The NCAA Playing Rules Oversight Panel approved the option to use coach to player communications through the helmets. Junior linebacker Keyshawn Elliott is one of the players wearing the helmet technology this season and is adjusting to the new role. I think it's forced me to, you know, communicate to the defense a lot more, you know, share the play calls, share the tips, you know, whatever we can. You know, defense is based off of communication, you know, pre-snap awareness. You know, it helps us play, play faster, you know, be on the same page. So ultimately, I, I like it. Players who have the coach to player communication will be identified with a green dot on the back of their helmet. Only one player is allowed to have this helmet technology on the field at a time. Coaches can communicate with players up to 15 seconds left on the play clock or until the ball is snapped, whichever comes first. The kids still have to play football. They can't be hearing you talk when the ball snaps, so give them vital pieces of information. If there's something important, say it in a concise manner. I think one thing that helps us there is the people who get talked to get talked by their specific position coach. ASU football equipment operations manager Brian Harrod is well versed in the new technology, having experience with it while at the University of Nebraska when they used it for practices. He's been a key part of training a rotation of players on how to use the helmet. On defense, we outfit six players for practice, three quarterbacks for practice as well. So between the different helmets we have, we have to swap the parts, the receiver, the battery, and the speakers each week to what helmet we're wearing. While there will continue to be a learning curve, all indications from players and coaches so far is that the new technology will be a benefit for the team this season. The helmet technology isn't the only new rule implemented this season. Teams also have the option of using tablets to view in-game video during the game. ASU has taken advantage of using the tablets and have stated how beneficial they have been in the game. In the sports newsroom, I'm Kayla Marinot, Cronkite News.